attempt to school her opponent, while Julianne Kelly is already a winner, having beaten cancer. But it's all coming up next in the 82nd Annual Daily News Golden Gloves. The Statue of Liberty, a symbol of freedom and hard work for a young country filled with immigrants. The Daily News Golden Gloves, very similar. Young, hungry boxers entering the ring looking to become champions. Hodgkin's lymphoma, the year 2001, go through cancer treatment, including chemo, radiation, completely bald, to come back as this super athlete. I don't know anyone who looks as healthy as her, as pretty as her, and she looks like she's gonna pull it off. And she has incredible skill, a lot of punching power as well. Julianne Kelly tonight as the women are center stage here at the Golden Gloves. Welcome back to the Daily News Golden Gloves here in the heart of New York City. The Wamu Theater at Madison Square Garden. We have had a great night of fighting for you this evening in the ring, the 132 pound women. And you know, these fighters take different roads to advance to the finals here at the Golden Gloves. Julie Ann Kelly is a perfect example. When I was 22, I uh, found a lump in my neck and I uh, did some tests and they did a biopsy and I had, I was diagnosed with stage 2A Hodgkin's lymphoma. So I went through uh, about four months of uh, chemo and then I had a month off to get a little bit stronger and then I did a month of radiation and uh, I got a clean bill of health in March of 2002 and I have been in remission ever since. Come on, come on. Come on. It's, it's definitely tough. It's, it's tough. it's tough on the mind, especially at 22. You look around and all your friends kind of don't have a care in the world. And you try and act like you don't have a care in the world the whole time. You're, you know, you're bald, you have no eyelashes, you have no eyebrows, and you got to go to chemo. So um, it's rough, but it definitely has helped me with boxing because every fight's a big fight. I already fought the fight of my life, so this is just... this. This is, I'm not nervous. It's, I, I already fought the hard fight. I'm going in. I'm going to have a good time. It's nice. Jab. Jab with the body. Jab with the body. This is just going to be fun. Once I stop having fun, I'll stop doing it. I'll find something else to do. But right now, I'm having the time of my life. Incredible to overcome those kind of obstacles at 22 years old. Now at 29, Julianne Kelly is one win away from becoming the 132-pound women's champion. And now the women's 132-pound championship. The referee is Prakash Tulador. In the gold corner, Sherry Redamozo. She boxes out of Lisa's gym, a 27-year-old sergeant in the United States Army. She is currently assigned to Fort Hamilton. Her record, one decision, one bye. In the blue corner, Julianne Kelly. She represents Mendez Boxing, employed in digital marketing, and originally from New England. She is 27 years old and now lives in Crown Heights. The record, two decisions. Julianne Kelly, Cherie Redamoza, 132-pound women in the ring. Four two-minute rounds. Kelly advancing 2-0 in this tournament. Redamozo has advanced to the final with one decision. And already Kelly looks very sharp. Let those hands go. Step back. Left hook. Followed up by a jab, right hand. Bunches and bunches already from Julianne Kelly, who moved here from Boston six years ago. Greta Mozo backing up. She's in trouble already. Pouring with the jab instead of snapping it. 
Metamozov's got to pop it. Kelly, the more skilled fighter. Absolutely. Metamozo punching with her chin up. Very dangerous. Notice that too, it's just up in the air. Nice body shot by Kelly. 38 seconds to go in the first round, scheduled for four. Lead right hand connecting. right hand. She does a nice job on that step back or rock back is what they call it. And that really backed off Redomozo. Redomozo tired already. Ten seconds to go in the first. Her hands dropping. And we'll stay right here. Use your right hand. You jab, jab, right hand. And use the left hook too. Throw four punches. No forget what to get body to you. Let your hands go. And when you get done, get out of the way. Three, three. Julianne Kelly in blue. Cherie Redamozo in gold. Second round scheduled for four. Four two minute rounds. The 132 pound women. Kelly off to a quick start again. Let those hands go, Gus. Triple hooks. Oh. Then goes to the body. Redomozo doing a good job of keeping her right hand up high. She's not getting caught flush with those left hooks. She just doesn't have natural movement or natural head movement, and that's why you can see the effects of the punches. Kelly keeps landing that overhand right. Great left hook by Julianne Kelly. Redomozo slowing down. Kelly so aggressive. A woman that's battled cancer, beaten it at 22 years old. And look at her, put them together now. The right hand, hand right landed. She goes to the body. That'll take a lot out of the tape. Again to the body. Right hand. These ladies really battling. Kelly in great condition for this fight. Right hand left oh, hook. Her up. And that backed her up. It certainly did. Here comes Julianne. Close it. Lead right hand. Kelly cannot stop coming forward. Redomozo trying to find a place to hide. <laughs> Ten seconds to go in the second. 